at me dance and then Zebra commands and today I am showing you my I'm showing you how I may eat my um dungeon generator. So as you can see it's generating the dungeon now and it will be done soon as you can see this there's these big rooms, there's chests, there's hallways, there's all kinds of stuff. There's like this Lots of this, yeah. Um, I'll wait, uh, it should be over soon. And boom, so now I'm gonna go. Oops. So now, so that's like how what it looks the generation looks like. So, how do I do that? Well, first of all, I have a at the start, I fill it completely in with. Stone crack. Then, and I activate this clock, which one, is, which sets, which one, which is how the the, the the um what's it called again? The like hallways. It had it will set block at and one of the at the random one of these armor stands, and these armor stands will. Teleport the armor stand and make it fill. Basic, which is pretty useful. And that's the and as well and as well as that when all of and when all of these have failed, basically, as oh it would only teleport and make it fill if it detects stone brick. So it won't go into here. So it won't do a blue thing. And when all of these fail, then it will um. Then it will activate this clock, which will and it will set the t to zero. It will set t. It will set at that. I understand this t score to zero and t and score to zero. Oh, I've been mentioning it some times. Anyway, and then it will add. And then on the clock, it will add the. It will add the. T, it will add one of to the t when the t reaches thirty. It will get teleported back to the middle, and when it reaches fifty, it will get. It will do some. It will like set turn this clock on. It will teleport you, and it will basic and it kill the Amazon. So it basically, stops everything and finishes it. So that's how the that works. As well as that, you have if you have a T which is less than two, you will you will set block at one of. The, it will set block at one of these three armor stands. The first armor stand adds one to the chest, um, like seeing the monster spawn thing and the um, red And this one will set block at one of these ones, and this one is uh, filling the air with stone break. Filling the air with stone break. Filling, filling the stone break with stone break. And filling this. The air, filling the stone break with air. So that's how this. So that's what this one does. This is to add a bit of variation and it makes the rooms and also if I go in I can go in and show you if I go in I can find yep here you see it yeah, it's filled this stone brick with mossy stone brick and it over here it's got some cracked stone brick. It's to try to make the textures a bit more varied. I don't know if it actually really works particularly well, but it I think it works. I think it does stuff. Anyway. So that's so as you can see that is what that one does, and as well as that one, I have, and then when my monster, when my MS score reaches, no, that's the one. When my MS score reaches eight, I will set block a redstone block at one of. Uh, we are at eight. Uh, no, that's the wrong one. Um, I will set block a block at one of these ones. Not these ones. Oops. These ones. Um, oh, I saw these ones. I'm just going to break these quickly. Uh, one of those ones, and they basically set block um, at one of the. Basically, just set block at the current corner. Uh, um, some stuff. So just yeah. Sorry, um, they set block at the current coordinate, a monster spawner, and that with and there are uh, different monster spawners you can have, so you'll just get one of the 
He's one this one is this one that summons scouts and strays, this one that summons the focus and vexes. So as well as so as well as that and then get to reset and basic a similar thing happens with chests, other than with chests. Well, oh no. Other than with chests, it um other than with chests it just sets block form with a chest with a chest with a specific um loot table and then resets it so and it uses nine instead of eight because I can use nine instead of eight I suppose. So that's basically how the and then once that's all and yeah. That's how it works.